The smallest handrail in the world? Wow. Ah! Wow. Dude. Oh my god. Y'all remember the good old days? I mean, I guess it's back, but Smosh back in the day. The man spider episode. He's like, well, I can't even remember what he says. But he's trying to become Spider-Man, but the spider wouldn't bite him. And he's like, well, I bit the spider. <laughs> That's good content right there. Anyways. We're here today at the Fremont Skate Park. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. And uh, we come here a lot. The one thing that I don't really think about and I take for granted living here in the Bay Area is that it is currently the middle of December and it is beautiful out here. Sunny, nice brisk breeze, and the vibes are just outrageously good. So for those of you who may not be able to skate right now, I hope that you can come on this journey with us today and you enjoy some skateboarding through us because that's what we try to do every single day at our in our video. But we have a, a special gift because if there's one thing I know about my guy Uzi Walker, who's over there trying to land a nollie inward heel, it's that he loves to skate rails. And when he wants to improve his rail game, there's always some kind of random rail laying around at the rail house that's only like six inches tall that he can go and practice on. So this right here was purchased for Uzi, so he has something that he can he can practice on. But Dan, oh, speak of the devil. Dan, this right here, this is for you, brother. This is the rail. This is the rail? Yes. This looks incredible. Yeah, this is perfect. <laughs> you know what, after so many years of coming up with dumb video ideas that sometimes the guys are not too hyped on, it just feels a little good in the soul when the guys say, this is incredible. <laughs> Literally the best reel I've ever seen. <laughs> what? Wait, what? Look at it, it's got two settings, but the bar can't go no, up two damn. settings. This is for the middle. Oh. I love it. Easy to put together too. Sometimes you gotta screw rails in. This is just easy. I easy mean put assembly. that middle piece on and come back to me. Alright. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Oh. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> Alright, Dan. One may have spoken too soon. Come on. Can't find the hole. Ah! <laughs> it popped on me. It's just good vibes out here, Dan. Good vibes. I like that I mashed this rail too. Wow. You what? I went golfing this morning. Oh, that's looking like a bigger crack. Oh, than this. Usual. This is a little sketchy, dude. Yeah, that's look at that. Right. It's a little scary. The sketchier, the better. See, I was mentioning, Dan, you like to use these smaller rails to learn tricks, and then you take it to the normal size rail. Look at how short this thing can go. Yeah, that's perfect. Damn it! Oh, there we go. Perfectly aligned. There we go. Perfect oh, rail. Man. Have you ever seen Uzi more excited for a video? Wait a minute. Oh, that's a good song, dude. All right, everyone. This is the X Factor Driveway Skate Park Grind Rail. It has 4.3 out of 5 stars on Amazon, 433 reviews. It's a fat 1.5 inch round diameter fat. rail. Oh, is this fat? fat? I don't, it's one of the skinniest rails I've ever seen. Uh, easy to assemble, no tools required. I agree with that one. Ideal for skateboarding, scooter tricks, and snowboarding. Mm. Wow, that would be interesting to try out. Let's see here if we got any more information. Not really, no. But we do have a customer review. Check the box for all parts. One star, bought this for my son's birthday, but it was missing the middle piece. That's wow. No good. Oliver O says five stars, verified purchase. Bro, this has like freaking lasted me so long, bruh. Alrighty, so this is a 12 year old kid writing this right now and this thing is real good. It's not sticky at all, so it is easy to do your tricks and I've had it for three years and I've left it in the rain for days straight and it's still perfectly fine. So it's durable. Let's see, one star. <laughs> Actually, I'll read two of them. Landon Mandela, one star. I got this as a Christmas present using Amazon gift cards. Once I got it, it was awesome at first, but once I got used to it, the rubber feet slides off when you go up to board slide. The rail slides from under your feet and sends you falling back to the ground. The rail is good. We just bolted it to my local skate park's ground. Glow, I know you want to do that. But if you intend to only use it as a portable rail, do not buy. And then another one, J.E. Andranian says, it's not a 54 inch rail, it's two 27 inch rails. A skate rail should be a single sturdy piece. This rail is made of two pieces that are connected in the middle by less than snug connector, causing the rail to sag, presenting a speed problem in the middle. Trough? Truff? True? How do you say that? Tro? Tro? Speed tro in the middle? I don't know. My English has failed me today. But anyways, those are some of the reviews. That's what Amazon has to say about it. 
we're gonna find out how this thing really skates. Let's go. Look at that. It's perfect. What a rail. Just look. If I've oh, ever look. seen a beginner practice rail, this, this is it. This looks so stupid. But, Does it? But you can pop on to any trick, commit to every trick, and you just get used to landing on a rail. And then once you're used to it, you take it to a normal rail and you can do it. You're right. That's how I learned front crooks. I had, we had a rail like this and I was like, oh, I'm going to figure out how to pop on the front crook. And I kept going like this and learning how to get into it. People were like, haha, like you're stupid skating that rail. Now I can front crook. I mean, you are really good at front crooks now though. Yeah, so. I learned them from one of these. And this is definitely better than the other one we had that was this size. You can literally try any trick and the worst that's going to happen is like, it may bend, but will it break, brother? Wow. Let's go. Back to 70 lip. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, man down. What happened? You got shinner, bro. By the rail or by the board? By the board. Oh! You got something against the little guys? Of course. No. <laughs> you almost said of course. <laughs> Hit kick to the front board, big spin front board. Nah, front crook. You're smoked out. Oh. That's, that's how I learned them. Not on something like this. Yeah. Literally exactly. This is like literally that. how Uzi learned them. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, bro, that's the trick I feel like this, bro. Yeah, I'm not. That's my dream. Holy! Look at that! Easy! Uh, Light fall! You're only a few inches off the ground! Wow! Dude, I'm oh. convinced! I'm sold! Here's what we could do, Dan. Let's do a game of skate, but you can put the rail wherever you want. Uh, I mean, okay, I guess so. Holy! Well, it's pretty cool. You can just put this in the trunk. You know, take it wherever you need. All right, here's what here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play a nice game of skate, and by we I mean Dan versus JD. Oh! The catch: you can put this rail wherever you want in the skate park. It could be on flat. It could be on an obstacle. It could be down an obstacle. It could be wherever you want, and that's it. Those are the only rules. Glow is the ref because he said, and I quote, he's a poser. This is how the best. Ah! You wonder? Oh, you wonder? Oh, how you to learn that 180 Smith? No, no, Whatever, no, down I don't the think Uto was learning on this. This is how he learned it. All right, let's get a little Rochambeau going. Yay. JD. The California Hot Boys first. He's going straight to it. What in the world are you thinking? Run 50. That would have been insane. Here's my trick, right? I'm just going back to flat because I'm learning this new trick right here. All right, fake you front crook. That's fakey 5-0. <laughs> what the Oh my god. I've never done this trick. Good place to learn. Hey, that was not bad. Yeah, that was pretty good, Dan. He said, no more flat. He's not a flat ground guy. Nope. You good? Yeah. All right, JD, you're getting hit with this NBD. NBD coming? Oh, oh, that's breaking. Wow. The smallest handrail in the world. I feel like I'm gonna break my legs on this thing. You got it, Dan. Oh! I'm gonna die on that. SK! Oh. He didn't pop. Oh, wow. He didn't pop. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not trying to shove 50 either. <laughs> I feel like this is secretly JD has been waiting for this game forever <laughs> some, for some reason. He's been conspiring against you, preying on your downfall. Gotta go the other side. Oh. Other side, buddy. Hey, that's perfect. That's actually sketchy. Oh that my. lip is crazy. Out of all the tricks that he could have done. Here we go, JD. Oh! Ah! <laughs>
Wow. I don't know why I have such a hard time with switch ollies. But. You don't. You're actually great at switch ollies, right? Yeah. You got to believe. Hey! Woo! That was so bad. <laughs> Rule number one. Don't ever poke the bear. Hey, it, it wasn't even, it had nothing to do with you and now it does. Oh! It's too easy. Oh my God. That is a T. That is? Oh wow. Him out. No. Well, you made me ollie the gap to that. Oh. I did an ollie to board slide. No, no, that. I thought the rail broke. I didn't know it, it was did. your board. The yeah. The rail broke too? No, this. Oh, man. GG. GG. I try tricks. It broke on the, tr on the last trick. Well, that means it's a 0 out of 10. Do it, not buy it. It's a board breaker. Yeah. Dude, I'm, I'm sorry, Dan. All right. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I didn't. When you, when you play the little whipper snapper skate, <laughs> put the rail anywhere. With the California Kid JD. Yeah. It's not. It's not a good recipe, huh? That's what happens. That's exactly what happens. Does that negatively impact the rail review, or? Yeah, I'm gonna nail this thing to the ground. <laughs> so what's your rating? I rate it five out of consideration that you can move it anywhere. Oh, what is this thing? JD, I got a question for you though. A good win. Have you been conspiring against Uzi for your entire skate career until now? I'm so sorry. It's yes. good. <laughs> Why in this game specifically did you choose to go after Uzi? I didn't. Uzi like said he wanted to play a game of skate, so I was like, I okay, like let's do it. Just he did say he wanted to play a game of skate. This is like when you're like, hey, you want to go play basketball with me? And your friend's like, yeah. And then they're like, like just going crazy, <laughs> like dunking on your head. <laughs> like, bro, I just, I'm not even wearing my shorts today. Like, I think I was doing like when you're playing Fortnite with your friend and you want to 1v1 them and they'll say they're going easy on you and they just go crazy and make you rage quit. I wasn't, I wasn't ready for that level of sending. I mean, you, you didn't even rage quit. Your board rage quit, Dan. Yeah, I'm just, your you know, board, I said your 245, board said, <laughs> 250, that's what happened. Your board said enough of this madness. That's what happens uh, when you're walking this. around at 250 pounds. You are not 250. Look at the board. It speaks for you itself. You are not 250. Why did my board break then? I'm not, I'm fat and I'm not even breaking 200. I'm 250. JD broke my board, so now I'm using his Yo, board. Wait, you said JD broke your board? Yep, so now, that's what you said? now I'm using his board to do this trick. You should break his. Alpha move. Doesn't matter if it looks well, cool. Them, they are gonna look cool. The point is that you're learning. Oh, I like it. There you go. Oh! 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 The rail's fire. Oh yeah! Oh! Bro, we got a full tornado going on right here. Hey, when I learn this though, these are about to be sick. We're gonna remember this video when you learn these. What was that, Dan? Come on, dude. Yeah. yeah. That was it. You just pop out of it, Dan. Oh! Oh my God, you're right. You're right there. Oh! Bodied. Skating El Toro. Oh! What the heck? It's like Pop Shove Willy. Oh, that was it. Yes. Oh my gosh. Uh, I think I'm done skating this thing. All right, what's your review? What's your review out of 10? 2.5 out of 10. 2.5 out of 10. <laughs> oh! You rated it low, but you tried it. That hurts my soul. <laughs> Dang, that, was that, count? <laughs> yeah, that was sick. All right, everyone. What do you think of this rail? We've gotten really mixed reviews, but just for me, who has filmed a lot of these videos and seen many rails, it did not bend, it did not break, and it did slide. So I would, I would say it's fine.
It, it is definitely like a really beginner rail though. I've seen some rails out there that are taller, longer, a little bit better for actually like skating and seshing. This one I think is like a, a pretty beginner basic rail, I would say. But anyways, like I said at the beginning of this video, I hope that you could join us on this video and, uh, and just skate along with us if you're not able to skate right now, wherever you're at, if it's snowing or something happened. I hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you in the next one. Yoshi.